everyone, welcome back to the Plunder Den and today's battle report. So in today's battle we're going to play a 300 point match and we're going to play the control the field uh, scenario. So I was kind of inspired in the last match uh, with my Henry Morgan, uh, I was defeated by the Brethren of the Coast. Uh, that I decided I, I think I'm going to play with the Pirates today. So I brought uh, Gene Hamlin and the pirate uh, Pirates faction. Uh, and let's see uh, who Gene has brought to the table. So it looks like he's brought a unit of freebooters uh, in this longboat with, uh, with a swivel gun. And he's brought a bark. So he's got a, he's got a bark here. Uh, it looks like uh, it has all its cannons uh, and all its swivel guns. He's got a unit of interplog, a unit of sea dogs, and a unit of uh, marines, which uh, uh, he's in himself. Gene's in that unit of marines. And then on the far side, he's got another longboat full of Forlorn Hope, uh, and it also is armed with a swivel gun. So those are our attackers. So let's take a look and let's see who our defenders are. So let's go around to this other side, to the table. And it looks like it's the Spanish. So forgive me, I'm, I'm sure I'm gonna mess some names up here, <laughs> but I will try my best. Oh, it looks like we got uh, Manuel Rivero in the Spanish militia. So let's see who uh, Manuel's brought to the uh, to the battle here. It looks like he's got a unit of uh, pikemen, and then he's got a unit of uh, milicianos, uh, quite a large one unit of them. Uh, and then we got a unit of cavalry, and uh, just behind this market here. And we got uh, Manuel is in a uh, unit of soldados, uh, soldiers, uh, and a unit of lanceros. Now I forgot to mention in the, the soldiers here, soldados, uh, he has a sharpshooter. Uh, and this, in this cavalry unit, uh, they have a commander, uh, so an officer. Uh, just some special characters I, I forgot to mention in there. So, uh, And let's go over to the uh, church grounds here, uh, where his other two units are. Uh, so he's got an uh, artillery unit with a master gunner and then a unit of marineros right here in the graveyard cemetery. All right, so those are his units. He also brought uh, some cannons, some artillery uh, that he's going to need to race to. So he's got a heavy gun right here in this gun emplacement here. And then over on the docks, he has a, a medium cannon right by the barrels here. And then over on the far side, we have another medium cannon uh, in, with those barrels. And then just in that fort over there, uh, there's a light cannon in that opening uh, in, in the wall there. So that's what he's got. He brought some artillery. Uh, of course, he's going to have to race to it to, uh, to control the field. So in control of the field, you, you want to have uh, your units as close as uh, the markers on the battlefield as you possibly can. So let's just kind of go over where the markers are. So really we just got this obelisk kind of sitting, sitting, sitting in the water here. Uh, and then we got the docks is one. Uh, and then across over here, uh, we have an island. So those three is where we have to control. Uh, try to get as close as we possibly can. Of course the defenders are gonna try to stop the pirates from staying there and the pirates are gonna start to stay there as long as they possibly can. All right, so that's the battlefield. Uh, and I will see you guys all in the Midway Report. Thanks for watching, everyone.